Hello my friends, yeah you, and uh, welcome back to Dark Souls, now I don't think we can avoid it anymore, we do need to go into the catacombs, now how you get there is from Firelink Shrine, and you can actually access this area in the very beginning of the game, but things are a bit different here, now these are not the strongest enemies, but they're for sure stronger than the Skeletons in the first city. Now, once you go down to the catacombs, um, ooh, I did get a new armor, by the way. Well, robe. It's a pretty good. It's got good stats. It's <laughs> the one that the channelers used, but you can't upgrade it. Now one thing, the skeletons in there, they do respawn, so that's kind of annoying, isn't it? But you need to have a divine blessed weapon, and you can actually, after you beat the moonlight butterfly, you can get the ember, and after that, um, the blacksmith can upgrade you weapons such as that. So if you hit them with blessed weapon, they will not respawn. Another way to stop them from respawning is... Uh, there's always a necromancer behind them, which do not respawn. After you beat it, even if you go to a bonfire, they don't. Now, fortunately for us, the Silver Knight Spear was dropped for me, so this should do holy damage. Now, other thing to note is that I haven't upgraded at all, so I'm just going to test out if we can even do anything with this. Because upgrading this weapon needs Twinkling Titanite, which is costs 8,000 souls and 2,000 to upgrade always, so that's kind of annoying, isn't it? Let's see, hopefully this is like uh, ah. Okay, watch out for that. It's a 3-hit KO or something like that. This is going to be painful, so even though we're pretty high leveled... Uh, well, maybe we can do this. Woo. So, yeah, skeletons. Which respawn. Now, these ones don't, but this is the very beginning. Let's go to the bonfire. Who cares about them? They don't give you too much souls. They're annoying. Oh, there is something we need to defeat. They do respawn. That's the guy you need to take out. <clears throat> Let's do this. So there's always like a dozen of skeletons and behind them at the very end is the necromancer. So as you guys can see it kind of creates a problem. Well, let's just move on. Um Yeah, maybe I'll Try with the spear, I guess. It's kind of annoying. Because I could probably just upgrade some sort of club or something like that with my resources. And, uh... Nah, these guys are not that tough. Like, with our current weapon, we can for sure one-shot these guys, but... That's fine, that's fine. Let's run through here. There's two different areas here. The first one is full of these skeletons, and as I said, these skeletons can be dealt with pretty easily, even in the beginning of the game. Maybe not 10 level, but... That's the guy we need to take out. So basically you're in a pickle. There's a lot of enemies. You should go after the necromancer, but in doing so, you're going to provoke all of the enemies, and they usually run away from you. Which you should try to prevent at any cost, so... This is a bad strategy, I am aware of that, but let's take out the guy, shall we? Now, now, now... And, uh, hopefully I'm still alive, nice. Still alive, boys! Please, 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 so... <laughs> We have very high armor, so that's the why we're still alive. If you go in the beginning... Make sure to have a blessed weapon here, that's kind of what I'm saying. But... 
Nice. Nice. That's a good weapon, by the way. Not, not a bad one, for sure. Now, these guys give you bleeding damage, so that's kind of bad. You do want to avoid that. Ah, there's these guys everywhere. 121 is not that much souls, anyway. But let's see. I... So I'm just gonna say, descending down here with the poor divine weapon like we have is not a good idea, but we should be fine. These guys give you bleed. Um, well, actually this thing seems to be a good armor for this place. So once again it's a good robe, but you can't upgrade it, but the good thing about it is, you don't need to upgrade it, it's really good. It's better than some of the armors without upgrade. You can of course upgrade them to be better, but... Souls... So that's kind of the thing I was trying to avoid coming here earlier on. Due to the fact that I was pretty underleveled when I was here last time. And uh, it was... It took me like a good four, four hours to get through here. This shouldn't take that long. Come on, explode already. Now you can't go across the bridge just yet. And the enemy placement is horrible like once again. Oh. Nice. We take those. Watch out for the skeleton. I think these ones do respawn, but for now I don't think there's much I can do. Need to switch for the spear, but Soul of a Proud King, that's really good. It's but on the other hand, they do respawn with this weapon, but it is a one hit KO. So, at least it gives me some time. Ah. So, ev eventually, we'll be chased by ah, <laughs> 20 of these. Let's try to get the Necromancer. Try to get past these guys. Good, good, it's looking good. Get him, get him. Get him. Nice. Ha. Yup. Since there's so many of these, I think changing this one to the one that heals us a little bit after every time we defeat an opponent is good. Now there's a trap here. I I think if you go here, you can drop down. That's that's not that bad, but I think this is the necromancer of this area, by the way. Hopefully. Nice. We do need souls. You can never have too much of those. Nice. We take those. Cause up we need to upgrade the. Flame arm weapon ding pyromancy. Nice. We are being taken by a critical hit and these guys do respawn, so that's ah. I do know where the next necromancer is, but there's also a bonfire up ahead. Come on, let me through. Here we go. What up dude? Come on! Quickly. Get him! These guys are going insane! Get him! That's not the way to go either. Go away, good sir. Go away, good sir. Where am I? Oh. Fine, fine. Fine. You know, you guys asked for it. Don't play me. And you can drop down from there. <coughs> Sorry. Mm. So yeah, this is one of those places you really should upgrade a divine weapon to deal with. 
Um, I think this is where we want to go. There's a bonfire here, and now we imagine being all the way down here. There is a bonfire, yes, but did I mention it's a secret bonfire? So imagine being all the way here. You don't know what to do. You've taken all of those skeletons. It's been... <coughs> Sorry. You're much lower level than me. Everything's crazy. You only want that healing spot and uh, it's here. There we go. Let's use one humanity, I think. This one here, here. I'm <coughs> oh, sorry. I went running, running last yesterday, and uh, it's kind of snowing or hailing in here in Finland. So sore throat. Here we go. How much do we need for a level up? Twenty six. So yeah. We are way over leveled here, but the levels don't mean too much in this game. It's all about, also a lot about the weapon and the gear you have on. But making solid progress, 10 minutes of recording and uh, we're in a good spot, I think. And uh, the 100 <laughs> souls we just got was an eager skeleton coming after us, so here we go. Maybe I sh just should go with the Divine Weapon. Let's kinda do that. This guy's respawning is just annoying. Maybe even though it's one hit KO, this takes like two to three hits or more, but... Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, I don't know how to use the spear. Dude. Dude, go away. Go away. Nice. So now they don't respawn. Let's let's use the spear. I think we're supposed to go in here. Treasure. Well, I don't know about the treasure bark, but there is a necromancer here, I guess. And yep, there's 100 archers gunning after you. Do not know about the treasure, but enemies, yes. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Got him. Get him. Get him. Nice. The spear ain't that bad. But for 10,000, I don't think I want to upgrade it. We should be fine. See if there's anything up here other than the annoying archers. And the game doesn't really tell you, by the way, that you need a divine or blessed weapon. I think actually even the skeletons are a little bit weak to fire, if I'm not mistaken, so the game is really unclear about that, but That's fine, that's fine. We don't need everybody all the time to hold our hand and... Where are my sheep? Where are my sheep? I can't find my sheep. And then there's like, bang in the background. We don't need the game like that too, so... These guys are actually pretty tough too. I do want to kill it with my spear. Does it respawn? Does not. Perfect. Does it? What is this? Something dropped down. Ooh, there was a treasure. Ooh, Dark Moon Sin's ring. Okay, we take those. Liar ahead. What liar? Huh? Okay. We don't see. Uh, 
hidden bath or anything. Maybe it's just somebody writing stuff. Ah. Check out the ring real quick. Sears something, was it? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. So it's not that difficult place as I'm making it sound. You could have a plus 5, plus 10 pretty cheaply, a good divine weapon, so... Just take the time and effort to do that, and uh, you'll be fine. Well, well, well. Who do we have here? Now, that's a really important item to do. We do need the Skull Lantern, because we're going to enter an area which is completely dark. I think there's a spell, a miracle, that shows you the light, and there's an another item, but for now we need to use the Lantern. Get through here. Right, here is where? Uh -huh. Miracle, Walk of Peace. Pace, peace. Uh -huh. Alright, alright. Yay! Yay, we step in the... Bam! In the trap. I don't have the time for you guys. I don't think the souls are worth it. 120. We are close to a level up, but... Kinda just wanna warp. Warp and... Um, wow. Let's go through here. If I was a madman, can I do this? I can. Bam! 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 Nice. I think we're on the right path. You don't necessarily actually need to go to get the treasure, but the good thing about that is also there is an extra necromancer which I think controls the skeletons on this area, so every time you start from the bonfire you need to battle the skeletons again and again, so that's kind of annoying. So now we don't need to do that, only once, and uh, come on, bam, you're so slow, let's take it in two hands, shall we? Nice, okay, okay, in two hands, it's much better, ay ay ay. <laughs> don't ask me, I don't know what those things are. Alright, what's here? Be wary of down, well, okay. I think there's actually one place you need to drop down, ironically, to get a good item, let's see, Silver Knight Sword for here, I don't think there's skeletons, but there's a demon in here, which I don't remember how difficult it is, you can actually go to lie down in this coffin, I think. What this gives us, I don't know. Maybe you can lure this play around with this opponent, but... Are you good? It didn't give me the option to hit it. Ow. Okay, okay. Let's see what you got, man. These guys are always kind of hard to deal with, but... They have, I think there's a lot of difference between them. Some of them are much stronger than the others. I think we should be fine. Oh, okay, that's not too crazy damage from our part. Let's try to be smart about this, shall we? And, oh, that's a high reach. But the fireball is good here. This guy has an incredible reach and a pretty unpredictable moveset, but dodging this should be good for us. Come on, dodge it! Just fast enough. Okay, run out of those. Let's heal just in case. Dodge this and uh, let's go! Dodge this, dodge this. Ay, 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 ay
Please don't do this to me. You're not that difficult of an opponent. Did I just roll perfectly into every of <laughs> these guys' hits? Alright, we are back here. Let's get that good, good 23,000 back. Now, this time I was jumped by three skeletons last time, so we were okay. So that's Dark Souls for you. So. Can I cheap shot him? I can. Ay -ay -ay. Let's try to be smart about this this time. This guy has a. We should be fine. We should be fine. We are doing great, great damage with this. Let's be smart about this one. High reach. Bam. And uh, bam. Nice. Bam. Almost. It's weird how how really differently the matches can go. This was very easy. Demon Titanite, I think. Upgrade items for weapons, if I'm not mistaken. And some goody goody here. Eye of Death. If, uh, those are items that you're supposed to give the Covenant, I think. Or. Or phantoms from other worlds. Well, oh! Phantoms as in good phantoms, or phantoms as in online players trying to, trying to destroy your progress, I wonder. I do so wonder. I gotta say, the 25,000 is kinda tempting amount fall ahead, yep. 25,000 is, is a mount I would really not lose, rather, but it's fine. We should be fine. Now, I wonder where the necromancer of this place is. Ah. Speaking of the devil, hi yeah. Bam, bam, and bam. From this point, Oh. Ah. From this point on, I think we should be able... they don't respawn anymore. But I've been known to make mistakes. Let's see. Please stay down, for your own sake. Looking good. These things are fun, they're still <laughs> really weird. Skeletons that use these pinwheels to hit you and uh, They do a ton of damage if you let them but if you, if you are patient you should be fine Dodge it Hit it ah. well, There was an item in there I think I am a little bit curious what's the item. Probably just more souls, but... The thing about this place is I don't want to go back to the bonfire, because... Because... I don't want to fight the skeletons all over again, so... Horrible bleed resistance, but... Let's see... Uh, this compared to... For example, this. Um, I think mine's better for now. I am kind of curious about this one too. Ah, well. We. Oh, I didn't remember this guy. Well, that's a surprise. I did not remember you. Be wary of a liar. Soul of a proud king. So that's nice. We get level up now. Ah. But let us proceed. I think there is a boss fight and a shortcut coming up. The boss is a magical, by the way, now that I think about it. Maybe you should 
switch the gear a little bit. Ah, it wasn't too... Ay, ay, ay. Come on, go away. Go away. These guys also drop these pinwheels, which you can also use as your shield, which is pretty fun. Oh. There is no pause game in this one, is it? Fine, fine, fine. I'm not quite sure how you get that, but I have a feeling you need to drop down. Yeah, there's a ledge over there, so... But let's not worry about that now. We are closing in on a boss fight, I think. Nine point one magic resistance. Um, to be honest, this one seems to be a good good choice here. What's in here? Safe zone. Are you sure? Never trust boss. Yes, it's a boss. Now, I gotta be honest, last time I defeated this boss in 15 seconds, I'm not even kidding. But I do know this thing is a very difficult boss. It multiplies itself, it uses magic, which we are kind of weak to. And... Um, yeah. Let's see what we have here. It is the main necromancer. I do like these intros, even though the game doesn't have many of these and not a lot of explaining to do what's going on, but... He's looking good. There's also water in there. So let's go ahead and... Uh, bam! 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 As you guys saw, it started to multiply and do a lot of damage, but... You may now kindle beyond the normal limit. Very nice. So now we can kindle the bonfires to give us even more... More... Estus Flash. Now one interesting thing, we get the Mask of Father. I think last time I got the Mask of a Mother. I think. What does this thing do? It's pretty bad. Slightly raises equipment load. Well, actually that's not that bad. Uh. Now, now we get to the interesting part. 46,000 is quite a lot. I think you can get to a bonfire here and then we need to do all of that. And then we go into the darkness, but I'm gonna go to the bonfire and see you guys. Hello, I just used the bonfire um, wayward bone to teleport to the bonfire and that's not how you get the item I mean someone has rode be very up down here so let's see should I roll should I walk off nice not so nice that's ah. it's helpful in a way because now we get to skip these guys you guys saw that. So let's enter the dark area, shall we? Alright, so here we are in the dark area. Now, I only have my blind playthrough. So I'm not quite sure how to do this, but I think you're supposed to use a skull lantern. Now, I think we're just going to use it in the other hand. Now we can protect ourselves with the shield. There are these indicators here for sure, but... I think there's a spell 
then there's this lantern and then there's a helmet that gives you light all the time and you can also do it like this but I highly recommend you having some sort of light because this place is a lot more difficult than the previous one so these guys are tough for sure Three hits with 100 weapon, that's that's good damage. Should be just fine, I think. Um, let's change this to the one that gives you a little bit more protection the physical attacks, I think. Now, these guys have a glowing eyes, so you should be able to see them. For now, but there are enemies which don't have glowing eyes, so the light is almost necessary. Oh yeah, we're in. Okay, okay, okay. We do some good damage with the pyromancy. More souls. Also, when I leveled up, I increased the two stages of the dexterity if you guys are interested. Just because it should increase. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, 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 Well, well, well. So we are back here. Let's see. It's The key to this place is to find the bonfire. I can't quite remember where it is, but that's the key. There's a couple of tight spots here. Other than that, find, find, find the bonfire. And uh, wow, did I just waste the entire one of my best spells? Nice. Find the bonfire. Make it to plus 20 and after that you are all good. Nothing to worry about after that. We don't need to take that guy anymore. There was only souls behind there. There's our previous souls. Now... We are getting shot in the back also, but nice. There's the other one. I kinda do want to use the shield. Because these guys hit you pretty hard. I don't know, this is how I'm going to juggle juggle around this place, I think. Between the shield and the la lantern. Ooh. Once again, important thing, find the bonfire. Find the bonfire. Where is the bonfire? Where is the bonfire? Bonfire is not here. It is not. And this place is a huge, huge maze. There is an archer there. There's somebody here. Okay. I think I went to the exact wrong way, but. Murakumo. Nice. Oh, oh, okay. I see. I see. You're right there. Good thing for us that the skeletons are so annoying. Are a little bit weak to the fire. Where is this guy? Well, whatever. I don't know where I'm going, but we should be fine. Because now we have a way backwards, which is pretty safe. Only one archer there. And there is a guy there, but he is not your friend. Okay. I think this is the incorrect way, but there's some treasure here, so... The fire seems to be very nice. Go, go, go! Throw it! Nice. nice. Let's try to see... There's other one. The eyes are already glowing. Nice. Fire gives us a little bit more light, and that's it. Uh, here we go. Um, so as I was saying, like, ah, ah, okay, here we are. 
I see. Do I? I think I see where we are. Ouch. Nice. Mm. I'm kind of curious about that Eye of Death, because I would really, really, really go for a hollow, hollow at our side in here. Person to help us. But if it does summon an online player, I don't want that, because <laughs> those guys are just going to get us, aren't they? So this is... Oh. This is not where I thought we were. But this is not that big of a place. It's not that difficult. I should say... Can I drop down from here? Yes, we can. So this... Is the very beginning, okay. Fine, we're fine. So eventually when you get a lot of these guys... This place becomes much more easier to deal with. Now oh, here we go. Here's a dude here. Good day. You look reasonably sane. What? Uh. Yeah. What well, is it? Tip? There's a stash of treasure right down that hole. I found it first, but well, you're the cleric, right? I owe you for all that uh, praying and whatnot. Well, go on. Okay, so that seems to be nice. This guy is telling us to go. Towards the light, towards the edge. What's in here? Here, okay. Is here. Does the, oh, come on. Does here mean that there's a bonfire here? Please make it so. Oh, nice, nice. Thank you, online player dude. Whoever wrote that. Now, let's use a couple of these, I think. Think. Let's see how, how much we can use this. Oh yeah, and now, now this place becomes much, much more manageable. Reverse hollowing. We did die when I tried to get that item dropping down after the boss fight. Let's do this. Let's kindle. One souls always plus five more. Well, one humanity so plus 15 very nice very nice oh my god this is so good finally plus 20 now we're talking now we're talking even though you can fast travel I don't think you can fast travel down here so we're going to go forward I don't want this episode to drag too long once again I want them to be perfect for you guys, but... So yeah, this guy's telling you to look down there, yada yada yada, I did. He is going to kick you in the ass and drop you down there, so... Mm, mm. Believe me, that guy's pure evil. Once you drop down there, there's a small, small intro and he's going to kick you in the ass. <laughs> now this place gets so... But we can get down there even without him kicking. Now this day, place takes a step further. You can't see them without the lights anymore. And these guys are much more powerful than the other ones, I think. They jump at you and they have a crazy attack pattern. So, pretty difficult. And there's no way to get light here. Besides your items or, or spells. So you gotta be careful. Use the light. That's my tip for you. Oh, 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 I didn't know there was... Is that a Black Knight or a Silver Knight? I don't care, we need to... Oy. Dude, are you crazy? Where did you come from? And we get sniped. Black Knight Halberd, I think that's a good item. Black Knights are strong. Oh, here we go. I think there's nothing more than three of these enemies here, but... Let's... Nice, we take those. Oh. 
Dude, are you insane shooting me all the time? Go away. A lot of souls, a lot of souls. I do you feel like we are closing in on another level up? Um, I think this is the way we would have been kicked down. Or is this a way to the bonfire? It's just an item. Um, nice. Weird looking shield. A figured shield. It's re really light. It doesn't have a hundred percent physical reduction. This thing seems to be like you can upgrade it this to have like lightning immunity, I think. Okay. By the way, remember the Grave Lord Nito in the beginning of the it was the cutscene, like the undead that fought the dragons, that's the one we're going after here. But for now I think I'm gonna go out of this place and let's get these guys. Ow. Because I think, yeah, once you get past these, these things kind of start coming up. So yeah, as I'm saying, the pyromancy has been really, really, really nice. We can shut one shot even the most powerful enemies down there which is really valuable as you guys see even though we have a decently good armor and a good weapon and stuff like that these things are dangerous down here and uh, now we get to fight these guys and uh, i think there's these little critters which are really hard to see and they're gonna come after you yep Nice. Powerful, but weak. Eey. Instant karma, I guess. Eey. Come on, go away. Once again, you don't need to battle these. You can go through that fog if you want. I am kind of curious on the items here, too. Now, we should be on the lookout for those little, little skeletons. There's these really, really small skeletons that are out to get you. White Titanite Chunk, so good good items, we are gonna take them. Come on, get him, get him, get him. These guys, <laughs> you see? Small, but I think they have a status effect, maybe Toxic or Mask of the Mother now, there we go. Let's try to get the items here, White Titanite Chunk. So depending on what type of build you're doing, you should get chunks are still the best ones. Ah, uh, there's so many of these. I think these guys respawn, or maybe they don't after you kill all of these. But Was that it? Is, is that it? Yeah, it seems like there's nothing shining down here anymore. This might be a small waste, but I think I want to heal myself completely full. So now, Nito. Boy, I wish I remember how to deal with him, but... Oh, one thing there is to note, there are respawning skeletons here, which are extremely annoying, so you could Maybe use a uh, blessed divine weapon, but we don't have one good for now. And this battle also starts by you taking full damage, so... That's Dark Souls for you. This is a pretty epic fight. Now, I do have a strategy for this one for you guys. Um, there's a pretty vast area you can go to, but note that there are a lot of skeletons here so the key to this one is you don't want to provoke all of the skeletons so stay here in the beginning where you drop off by that you'll be fighting like nido and five skeletons if you go much further you're going to be fighting nido and uh, a lot of skeletons so my advice to you is 
Stay here. Wait for Nito to come. And once you get to Nito, ignore these guys. Because there are a lot of these skeletons here. Oh, I was just about to say, I guess I could kind of try to KO them here, but am I fast enough? Don't think so. It's that one. Let's see if we can take care of these guys. Let's see. Come on, come on. Hurry up, hurry up. This is stupid. What are you doing? Come on. Get him. Okay, enough with that. Enough with that. Nito it is. It's giving us toxic or something. Oh, that's bad. I should have remembered. So, Hawk Nito. Hawk Nito. That's the... Because it's going to do an attack, which we need to very much dodge. It's going to do a lot if we are near. But the good thing about that is that also takes care of all the skeletons. So, Hawk Nito. Hawk. Okay, maybe not. Ah, we got toxic. Are you kidding me? Okay, we're not gonna make this one. I'm... Oh my god. It's not the end of the world. Toxic is... I have a cure for it, but... Come on, go, 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 go. I don't want to take this damage. Be quick or be dead, come on. How far is it? Are you crazy? That was so close. That was stupid. Get off me. I should have remembered the toxic. I should have remembered the toxic. It's not it's not the end of the world. We can still do this. We can still do this. Believe in me, believe in me, believe in myself. Hey. This guy was not that tough. There was a strategy for it. Just kinda can't remember what it was. Okay, go, 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 go. There we go. They need one of these. This will increase your stamina regeneration. Now, watch out, watch out. Roll. Oh, I got toxic again and I got completely hit. Believe me, I got this on my first playthrough last time. Maybe it was weak to fire or something. Maybe I did use a blessed weapon, but... This is not going according to plan. Not by any means. I am going to lose this. I'm sorry. We provoked even one of the giants, so... Oh, please, please, please. Go away now. Come on. Get him. You can't hit backstab this guy, I think. Come on, explode already, explode already. Nice. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Dude, are you kidding me? Okay, somebody's hitting me. Oh, it's one of the big guys, isn't it? Ah. I'm, I'm just struggling, I'm sorry. This is... Come on, dodge it. Heal. Oh, come on, the old double slice and dice. Please, 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 heal, heal. Oh no, I'm sorry. <sighs> no, 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 no. Please, Nido, please. This is the one thing we need. 46,000 back, please. This time I have also two spells. I don't know if they're gonna come handy. A lot of potions, two spells. As you guys saw, the further you go, the worse this match is gonna go for you. Just, there are giant skeletons and stuff like that. Those are the ones we do not want to provoke, so... Let's be here. Let's take one of these. It's not necessary, but it helps you with stamina regeneration and... Uh, this time, let's not... So, dodge. Is he loading the big shot? No. Just collecting himself. Alright. Dodge. How did I last time prevent toxic? I, I one shot at this. Guy. Like, believe me, this wasn't even a difficult fight last time. Please don't hit me. Like, dude! Dude! 
I even rolled. This is not a fun, fun uh, way back here, I gotta tell you. Here we are. This time I have a much better armor and um, I have now sacrificed. We don't have the parama. Oh my god, how did I do so much damage again? Take. Uh, this time we don't have the paramancy hand. I don't think we need that one in this match. Although it could be good and trying to balance between the spear and the short sword. Let's see if the spear can take down those little skeletons without them getting back up. Let's see. If it doesn't, then we'll go back to the hand hand strategy and I don't know, let's see how much our best paramancy does against me though. But I still gotta emphasize this wasn't like one of the God, the easiest battles I've done. Like I one shot at this guy. This was easy. This was like easy. This was like literally easy. All my friends were like, oh this thing this thing is so bad, this place is horrible, and I was like, what? But now I see. Let's see if they do come back. Come on, stop it. Please make it stop. Alright. Let's get out of the toxic. Heal and let's get this guy, shall we? Okay. Wow. I was just about the roll, so come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, man. Okay, so dodge. I have nerves of steel, but I gotta say, this thing is not going in our way. Like, at all. Get him. Now, dodge. Is he going to explode now? We did get rid of all the small skeletons, so that's good. So, dodge. Hit him, hit him, hit him, dodge. Which makes it so that he can just hit it in the back. Come on. Dodge. Wow, we even actually plucked one of his shots. That's crazy. He's going to explode, he's going to explode, he's going to explode. Get him. Dodge. Wow, I actually dodged one hit. Note that, note that my friends. I did manage to dodge one hit. Boy, I'm bad at fighting at this guy. Wow. He did get hit. I'll take my words back. This guy is difficult for sure. Is he loading up? No. Come on, get him. Dodge! Oh. Wow, I guess I dodged. If I, if I only had my cow's hand now. Come on, come on. Don't choke now. Please don't choke now. Come on. Dodge! Get him. Get that fool. Get him. Go down. We did it. We did it, my friends. Yes. Uh-oh. We did it. Did we? Peach. <sighs> Lord, so we did it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Probably screamed a lot. Ooh, that was crazy. Okay, this thing is a lot more difficult. 60,000. Look at our souls. Look at our souls. <gasps> 100, 1,000. So there's not much else here. You can also use that soul from the boss too. Oh, there is. You can actually, I think, enter. Well, whatever. Now, for the end of the episode, let's go ahead and try to increase the weapon. So note yourself, have a divine weapon, for sure. Getting rid of those small skeletons was... I think it's not necessarily, but it really did help us a lot. Because when you're done to dodge and stuff like that, it really does throw you off guard. Now, Toxic is kind of bad, but if you were near Nito, he didn't do the toxic attack, so that's fine. And by the way, at this point, these things are not very usable, but 
I think I wanna upgrade my cows. For sure. This thing is expensive, but believe me, that's how we roll. So it's now maxed, I think. You can offer humanity here, but no. Now I think you can ascend this by finding her sister in the swamp, but for now, that's going to be the episode. We did get Nido. Very nice, very nice. Much more intense battle than I remembered. I now feel I got extremely lucky first time, but that's sometimes how it goes. When you were near him, he doesn't use the toxic attack. But, and getting rid of the small skeletons was definitely the play. That's going to be it. We have taken down two of the four bosses. The main, main big ones, which we need to deal with. Next episode we'll be going down to the demon ruins. So, hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Bye.